Ah, uh, how we got another state patrol video guys and we got another video where i got a call out and i gotta embarrass a little homie who doesn't know what he's talking about this guy is an american and a barbadian who doesn't even live in the united states know more about his law and where he lives more than him that is quite embarrassing in our server in dvrp we have our state patrol department modeled off of arkansas state police arkansas state police is one of the few departments in the united states who do not have a pit maneuver policy what does that mean that means that they do not have any policies that suggest that they are allowed they aren't allowed to pick somebody out at over a certain speed so for example there are certain sheriff's departments within the united states the continental united states who cannot pick people over 50 miles an hour arkansas state police is not one of them in fact they are one of the most famous departments for pitting people out at over 100 miles an hour take a look So this guy, he racked up a couple of offenses that would suggest that we needed to take that level of force to take him into custody. But that wasn't all he did. This homie got ended up getting himself banned by breaking three to four other rules within this entire RP sequence. And I'm going to break it all down and show y'all what exactly he did. And on top of that, he literally admitted that he broke one of the rules unbeknownst to himself, which suggests that when he joined the server he did not read our rules and understand our rules correctly and i want you and if you see this video little homie i want you all i want you to see this video and realize how wrong you were and how stupid you were for taking the route that you did because you could have actually learned something today but you didn't you decided you were gonna be an emotional little wreck an emotional little girl and you wanted to call people out even though you were wrong let's hop into this one y'all Oh, you got a nice car. I like it. Yeah, I nice Honda Civic. Yeah, Civic is nice. I, it was only one thing that wasn't stopped, so. Oh yeah, the yeah. the owners the owners here. I'm not gonna lie to you, they're pretty bad. Oh really? Yeah, they 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 don't know how to manage their business very well. The government has okay. to had to you know come in and do some audit. Um, I'm checking for you if the mechanic slots are open. They are not. Uh, oh. but we could. I'll if anything, I'll take you down to the to the seven three five so you don't get pulled over for not having okay. a plate, and then um, you should be good to go from there. Okay. And if anything, if you have any issues, I'll I'll let you get my contact. So if anything, just oh. call me if you have any issues. Yeah, I don't have a phone. <laughs> Yeah, that's why. That's why I mean when we go over there, you get your phone and set it up, and then I'll give you my contact. Okay. Uh, what's the city limit? Say that again. What is the city limit? The uh, city limit to drive. Per the, the city limit to drive. Yeah. Was it mean speed limit? Yeah. Uh, when you get in the car and you get on the road, it will tell you down at the bottom left or right. I don't remember. Oh. It should tell oh, okay. you. So you just stay below that. You can just follow me. Can I take the um, share sky over there and stuff? Uh, how much, much more money do you have? I only have two k right now. Um, yes. Get the registration and insurance. This dude. I'm gonna pull him over. Yeah. What's going on with you, man? Man, man, why, why you speeding around like that, man? That's irresponsible, dude. I did like 45 and 35. I that is, it's, it's still 10 over. Come on, man. What's going on with you, man? I'm trying to test out for my bike. Yeah, but you don't drive around like that. You gonna kill somebody, man? Nah, I was being safe. 
And that all looks safe to me when you didn't come to a complete stop at that red light. It you want right to You want a ticket? You got be, to, to, to turn right on red. You have to come to a complete stop first, sir. I was. It was like a one mile per hour rule. It doesn't matter. It's still not a complete stop. That's what the law clearly defines, sir. What's going on with you, man? You gonna give me a ticket? Not today. I'm just. I'm giving you a warning right now. All right, you go on, man. Just, just slow down with the vehicle, man. I know it's the fast car, but come on, man. Got it. I might be in depth. <laughs> <laughs> really? Yep. I'm in minus one, one thousand four hundred eighty-two in depth. So. Okay. Uh, do you have cash on you still? Uh. Check your pocket. Yeah, I'm checking. Oh, no, I do have cash, yes. Okay. And uh, let's go over there. And then you can put it at the bank over there. There's a bank in there as well. So. Okay. Sounds good. Two seven, two seven, ladies. Two seven, I got that stolen vehicle. 853. Can I get additional 32s? Two Follow me very He's closely. Off, There's a pursuit We're going on, taking so we gotta left be quick. Left. Okay. We're gonna be on Strawberry Avenue. Take, uh, yeah, we uh, we're gonna be taking a left off the left. We're gonna see, uh, Strawberry Avenue going northwest. Postal 835. Taking on the right, right, right in front of Legion. I lost ours. 100 PD unit, go back, uh, towards that, those other peers. This is somebody different. Very well, I got him. He's going 745. We're going to be on Olympic Freeway right now. We're going to be taking the La Puerta exit. Hello. Going, Hello. going northbound. 739, Hello. 739. Uh, the parking lot is over there. Opposite lanes of traffic. I parked it over there. Yeah. Yeah, just park it over there. lanes of traffic. We're going to be taking a Del Perro Freeway. Uh, I'll be back. I'll meet you back there. Yeah. 741 now eastbound a little uh Del Perfect way. 400. What kind of vehicle is it? It seems to be an Oracle. Black and color. 104. You still got eyes on it? 104. I'm right behind. It's gonna be 766 Del Perfect Freeway going to eastbound. 772. Still on the freeway? 84. We're gonna be on Tower Way. 798, 798, hop back on the freeway. We're going to be making a left hand turn. We're going to be in the dirt field now, 791, 791. Yeah, we're in the boulevard. We're going to be on Labor Place, 792, 792. Made a right hand turn on Amarillo Way. We're going to be hopping back on the freeway now, 793, 793. Unit turn around, what are you going to turn around, turn around, turn around. All right, so right about here is where I personally clocked all of the offenses. The first one is going to be driving oncoming lanes. The second one is going to be the unrealistic driving that's breaking several rules. And we're going to do a little counter of all of the stuff that he's broken. So you guys can actually see uh, where he went wrong in terms of, you know, this entire RP sequence, everything. We're going to be getting on Los Santos Freeway, 590, 590. All right, Wander, you're going to be outpacing me, so if you want to try to stop him. I'm probably going in for a pit. We made a U-turn on the Freeway, 585. Fucking tabbed out. That was good. I'm out of pitting. Uh, trying to be tricky. Yeah, but uh, that shit not working. This is shit I do when I run away from cop. We're gonna continue southbound Los Santos Freeway, lower pillbox. Pit out, pit, 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 pit. Ooh, wow. 
The brakes on this car are really good. You're making a leaf on left onto integrity way. Vehicle flip. Hands! Hands! Damn. Let me see some hands. Right now. Hands! Do it right now. Hands! Hands! Put your hands up. Put your hands up. Put your hands up. Put your hands up. If you move that car, I'm gonna shoot you. Put your hands up. Get out the car. Get out the car. Get out the car. Suspect down, suspect down. Shots fire, suspect down. Seven nine, seven five nine. As you guys would have seen right there in that sequence, the reason he got shot is because he drove the car towards officers. We had him completely surrounded. Cars at the back, we have officers in the front. If you drive your car towards an officer, that is perceived as a threat. That is perceived as a threat on that officer's life. And you can be shot for something like that. Whenever, if you guys ever end up in that situation, put your hands up. It is not worth it for you to try to get away and end up getting yourself shot. In the the stupid thing that he said uh, in the, in our Discord was that we shot him 40 times. I'll let y'all go ahead and count it so that you could see or, or tell me down in the comment section below how many times was he actually shot between myself and the other officer. Move that car towards me, you get shot. <laughs> that's that's all that's gonna happen. I'm gonna be gonna be clear. Let's get a siren check coming from the line. You'd never believe that this is a guy I just spoke to. Alright. 100. Does anybody have a medical bag? Ten four. Ten four. Let's let's start getting a uh, medical treatment on this guy. I'm gonna start processing the scene. Uh, it's not gonna work. He's on his butt. Uh oh! I thought I thought uh, I was meaning the uh, the S A F R one with the with the defib. Yeah, dude, I don't got no more cuffs. I ain't, I ain't cuff him. Uh, officer, cuff him. I don't got no my cuffs no more. I got. I heard it was like they're ramming me. What is that? I'm like, bro, like you, you run it. Like you, you, you literally posing a threat to the public, driving on coming lanes and everything. Of course, we're gonna ram this shit out of you. Yeah, I was. I was waiting until we got at least going off the highway. Like right here was the perfect spot because there's no locals. But where we was at earlier, there was too many vehicles on the highway. Yeah, that's all. That's all good. I I was more worried about him actually <laughs> striking somebody. Yeah. You know they they can't drive. Got a blood spot right here. Take a picture of that. Right. Nothing in the vehicle. I'm gonna go ahead and uh take some pictures and impound it. All right. I I got pictures already. You want like. Uh, the plate. Yeah, I got pictures of the car, him on the ground, all kinds of stuff. I could put him in here. Let me transport him. He's not responding to anything I'm trying to do. Yeah, transport yeah, him trans to, uh, the, lane the, the, the um, transport him to the hospital and then transport him to Vespucci PD. PD. I'm gonna put the rest yeah, of the stuff in your car, the, the pictures. Two seconds, I'm gonna transfer it one dead hospital. Uh, you know, 
the, uh, the transport unit, did you get an uh, ID off of? No, right now, I do it uh, at the hospital. Why the fuck won't you search him? Negative, stop. Uh, take him out the car and search him before you anything. Gotta search the suspect before you leave. Oh, these before you get them in your car. Get, you 400, you can show me back in it. You say you did get pictures of the vehicle already, aren't you? Yeah, I put them in the back of your car. Um, I got pictures of the vehicle, him on the ground, and some other, a few other things. Alright, hello? Hello. Alright, yeah, see you got your cell phone. New one, yep. 14. Yeah. Okay. How do I uh, send you my... So, go to the phone icon, bottom left. Oh, okay. And you see your name on the top? Yeah. Right, um, so then just click on that, and then go to share contact. Our units go over here at 759, so it's going to be full for our units going back oh, to me. There we go. I think. Daniel? Yeah, Daniel. Uh, I just... That's fine. Mm, I'm going to go fix one. Show me back to Nate. We're going to see if this car can win a rainbow. 503, we're back to Nate. All right, I just sent it to you. That's for me. I think I accepted it. Uh, Commissioner yeah. Webb? Yes. Yeah. Uh, just you could go back to that same phone icon and you would just see all your contact. Yeah. There you go. So it's in there. Uh, I'll just send you a quick message so you can see it. Yeah. There you go. All right. So I got a mechanic. Um, I think it's on duty. Let me, let me oh. talk to him really quickly. Of course. Uh, is it a problem if I don't remember my password? Uh, yeah. No, you won't be able to get back in your phone. Man. Oh shit. <laughs> you forgot uh, your password already? Uh, I didn't realize I put one in. Oh no. Uh, two seven, only 100. 100, go ahead. There's one number though. Wait. Well, the individual transport left the game. No, and I don't just remember. Came back. Oh god. Was this the second rule break? Let's go further into the video and find out what actually happened. Uh, oh, that's, that's a problem. That he left the game? 10 for you. He's not in my car no more. Uh, is that him that just joined back? Uh, I believe so. Yeah, I don't remember my password. Did he join back on the same character? Or the same persona? Uh, I don't know. 10 for Just wait a few seconds, see if he's gonna come back there to the hospital. If he doesn't come back, then we'll handle it, uh, in Discordia. 10 for Right. I mean, that's like... Sorry about that. Radio was calling me. Yeah, I don't remember my password. Uh... Yeah, I don't know how to help you with that one. Other than you might need a new phone. Alright, hold on. Might need a new phone then. Yeah. Alright, just go ahead and scrap that one. Uh, oh, no, I got it. I got it. You got it? You just write it yeah. down then. I'm just gonna remove my password. I don't want it. Okay. Uh... I'm not sure how to do it, so... I got it. You got it? Yeah. Okay. Sounds good. Alright, um... 280, test me to the, um, the most recent call. Trying to get in contact with the mechanic here. I know this one is... Hey, he just DM'd me on Fergie. I just literally threw something from the closet. I couldn't find a good outfit. Yeah, there's a clothing store in there as well. And there's a bank. Did you see the bank? Uh, no, I have not seen the bank yet. Okay. Wait, I thought I could turn it off, but I guess not. What's that? Uh, okay, that's weird. Should work. Okay, uh, let's go over to the mechanic. Ow. I'm Damn. so sorry, I'm so sorry. Muscle spasm, sorry. That's okay. Um, let's go over to the mechanic shop and, uh, Wait, are you okay? get yourself a plate. Yeah, alright. I was didn't mean to. <laughs> That's okay. Fine. Responding to that last uh, 1066, that night blade was outside of the uh, bank. On 596, I'm gonna take a closer look. Him popping up here unscathed. Um, somehow able to run away after being shot multiple times in the face and the chest, without him repeating his injuries. You know break this rule too oh, good. you said that guy Andre, i have that individual over here 738 the one that you just arrested 
You better stop. Stop running. He's running. He's running. He's running. You better stop running, man. What's going on with you? Stop running. Stop running. Stop running. Stop running. Stop running. We're going to be heading uh, southbound on the Alta Street, I believe this is. 738. Stop running, man. I'm going to beanbag you. I'm going to beanbag you. Stop running. If you don't want it, stop running. I'm not playing with you, man. I'm not playing with you. I'm going to give you one last chance. Stop running. Stop running. Beanbag deployed. Stop. Stop running. We're going to be 738 in the uh, the intersection by Vespucci and, and uh, I believe it's the Alta Street. Stop running. Stop. 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 I'm not playing with you. Stop. Combat log again and see what happened. I ain't combat log, bro. I seen the light on my way to thing. I just held E, bro. As you guys just heard, Drew, to his own admission, he just admitted to combat logging. If he had read DVRP's rules and regulations, he would also see that combat logging isn't just leaving the game. It is also responding without permission while in an RP situation that can result in a ban. He just stated that he saw the light while on the way to the hospital. He was within the officer's car. And if you guys recall earlier, the officer said the guy disappeared from inside of his car. He was within the officer's capture already. He was in the officer's custody and he took it upon himself to combat log, which as is defined here in the DVRP rules and regulations, responding without permission while in an RP situ uh, situation can result in a ban. Logging off or forcefully responding to avoid situations is not allowed. So not only did he see the light and went to the hospital, he ran from that hospital all the way over here to avoid the situation. He clearly broke the rule. Get this bum out of here, will you? Just get this bum out of here already, huh? All right, sorry about that. I had to go handle that real quick. Yeah, all good. All right, come on. All right, so the moral of the story. Um, listen, dude, you wouldn't have gotten this much attention and this much embarrassment if you didn't uh, press the issue and if you weren't that emotional about you getting a ban, talking about how I, uh, I, I, I have a sensitive ego and stuff like that. No, I know you were wrong. You were wrong and you got banned based off of these facts that I listed in the video. You were the one in, in this case who have a sensitive ego because you believe in your wrong and incorrect information about how law enforcement tactics are. I've done the research in speaking to law enforcement officers, both present and former, on what they can and can't do. This is something that a lot of the American public don't actually they don't, they're, not, they're so lazy that they don't actually seek out the information that they need to be able to articulate and conduct themselves in a, in a manner within law, enforcement or within law enforcement interactions. A lot of the members of the public in America don't actually know how things are supposed to be done. They don't know any policies and everything. And one thing I will teach you here today is that, and this is something that I've spoken to an actual former cop in um in my community and i have a community full of n not only active but former cops and people learning to be cops at this point in time each state in the united states have different laws and different things laws vary from state to state for example there's going to be a state with a stand your ground law there's going to be other states that don't have a stand your ground law you need to understand what state does what and which law is valid within that particular state for example in New York, you can't have certain um, certain classifications of guns, whereas in Georgia, you can. There's so many. Each state has its own law, and there's differences, and you need to figure out what the differences are. Each department, additionally, has different policies and different ways of handling situations. Arkansas State Police, and I'm pretty sure GSP, Georgia State Police, they can pay people out at any point in time. And on top of that, a state agency versus a local law enforcement agency, such as a Atlanta PD 
they might be they might have different policies when it comes to dealing with somebody else because inner city policing and state policing are two completely different things they well not really fully completely but they have differences they have differences that are that 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 ju govern how aggressive cops are in versus the other one and what i when i talked to this this former cop today he told me that state troopers are usually a, more aggressive due to the fact that they have completely different jobs they have different factors and things in place that allows them to be more aggressive with people versus an intercity department so with all of that being said i've done my research you haven't you probably one of these dudes that look on the internet and TikTok for your information instead of actually going down to your local de police department and asking the viable questions that you need to ask so that you can better inform yourself and better be able to handle the, the, the life out there. So instead of coming in here and coming in my chat telling me some bullshit, maybe you should actually go and find out the information for yourself so you can better inform and argue your point. Your points, and I wish I had those Discord messages, your points were completely invalid. You didn't get shot 40 times. We are fully within our right to ram you off the road because you were endangering the lives of the public, etc. And the reason why we didn't do earlier was because you were in and around other locals. And we are treating the, the AI within the game as actual citizens. Okay? So don't come in here with that kind of stuff. You got this energy because you asked for it. And I hope that you feel contented with the shit that you got today. Anyways, if you guys watched this video all the way to this point, I appreciate y'all. I'll see you guys next time. Have a great day. Have a great week. Peace, everybody. Enjoy your week. I'm in my element. Back in my element. I'm in my, I'm in my element. Back in my element.